Down payments or advance payments are the payment methodology that entertains various business organizations to provide its customers with an option to make the payment for the purchase in terms of a longer or shorter period of time. And sometimes a down payment is required for expensive orders or projects. So it's well appreciated among people as it allows the customers to acquire the product only for a percentage of the total amount at the initial stage, that means a partial payment, and could pay back to the seller in small amounts for a duration until the total sum is met. So let's see how we can request for down payment in order of obtain. So to use this feature in Odo, just open sales module and go to configuration settings. There you have to choose a default down payment product. So you can see I have already created a down payment product and set here. And you can click on this external link to view the details. So this product will be used as default product for advanced payment. So you can see the details, like this product can be sold, can be purchased, and I have set the product type as service. And you can see I have set the invoicing policy as prepaid because uh, this allows the customers to make advanced payment before having the products. So before delivering products, we can create invoice for customers. I mean, invoice for advanced payment. Then here, when you come under accounting, you can set a specific income account for this down payment product. Now just save the product form and save the settings. Now let's create a new sale order. Choose a customer. And here, if the customer orders product villa, and if the sale order is confirmed, you can see we can create invoice for this product. So invoice can be created for order quantities or for delivered quantities that depends upon the invoicing policy set on the product. So for Villa, we have set it as for order quantity. So we can create regular invoice before delivering the product to customers. And along with this regular invoice, you can also find option for down payment. So advanced payment can be done by the customer as percentage and as fixed amount. So suppose the customer want to make an advanced payment 25 percentage of the total amount. We can set the percentage here and click on create and view invoice. So here we can view the draft invoice generated automatically by Odo. You can view the customer name. And here you can see that down payment product has been added to the order line, that is invoice line. So you can view the label, down payment of 25 percentage. And now you can see the account set here is the account that we have set as income account for the product down payment. And you can view the total quantity and price. So this price is a 25 percentage of the total amount. Now we can save this and confirm the invoice. And if customer have made the payment, we can register the payment by choosing the journal and payment method. And after reconciliation, this will be moved to paid state. Now let's come back to the sale order. So here you can see along with the product, a new line is added, down payment. And here you can view the total price. 
Now again, you can click on create invoice. So here you can see an option enable to detect down payments because we already have made the payment. That is customer have already given an advance payment, 25 percentage. So again, he can make another down payment as percentage or fixed amount. So now let us choose fixed amount. Again, we can create invoice. So here we can view the total amount for which invoice is created. Now we can register the payment. Now when you come back again, you can see another line is added. Then we can deliver the product to customer. And after delivery, if the customer wish to make the payment, remaining payment, you can create a regular invoice. So again, we can click on and can see an invoice, draft invoice is generated by detecting the down payments done before. So you can see the total unique price of this product here. And from this total price, the down payments are detected. So here below you can see the total amount that need to be paid by the customer. So this one is a remaining amount. Now we can confirm this and make the payment. Now you can see the amount due is zero. So that's how down payments are done in order 15 sales. And if you have any doubts regarding the invoicing policy in order 15, you can check the link above. And if you require any order implementation or customization in your business, drop a request to odo at